Good morning, good evening, good afternoon. My name is Sarah Picorn, and today I'm bringing you back with another goddamn video. So, listen. I, um, tried this, tried to record this, um, you know, about, the, should we say, nine times? Um, so, <laughs> I, I don't, I don't have any words, to be honest. Like, I'm just... I'm lost for words, if if anything, really. Um, it on my eighth attempt. I think it's. I think it took nine times. Um, on my eighth attempt, um, it turned out fine. You know, it was like it was a pretty bad voiceover overall, really, because um I kept coughing. Um, I'm just gonna give another disclaimer now because I might still be coughing. Um, <coughs> yeah. I'm still coughing. Um, that was actually not planned, but you know, it worked perfectly. Um, I don't know why, but my throat just decided to be really sore all of a sudden. So if I start coughing, then you know why. And I'm not gonna say sorry if I do cough further on the video, but you will know why I am coughing if you like are listening to this right now. So yes, I might be coughing in the future, <laughs> part of the video. But in the whole video on the last one, I was coughing um, um, and I didn't really know what to say either because I didn't really plan anything. But bear in mind, I still haven't planned anything. So, you know, I'm, I'm a disaster. But <laughs> um, I thought it was fine. Like the, the end result was like 25 minutes, but I only filmed a 20 minute voiceover. So the rest was just the, you know, the elevator music, like, you know. So I, I was fine with it. But then when I was like trying to export the video, it was just like, lol, no. And then it, it crashed. Like, I don't know if it crashed, like it stopped responding. And you know when it like stops responding for about 10 minutes. So you kind of just have to force shut it down because like there's nothing else you can really do except wait. And I wasn't planning on waiting like half an hour for it to start responding again. So I shut it down and then I opened it back up because I was expecting like the way, um, the way, I always forget what it's called, <laughs> the way uh, Premiere Pro, Adobe Premiere Pro, the way it works is that like, it automatically saves, well I assumed it automatically saves, but it doesn't, <laughs> so you know, that's just great, it doesn't save, I'm gonna bear that in mind, um, so I should have like saved it before I started exporting, um, so basically I didn't have the, foot the footage anymore, like I had to start again, like I had the footage, um, but I didn't have the audio for some reason because I'm pretty sure I deleted it as soon as I put it in, um, Pre Premiere Pro. So that is, <laughs> that is why it didn't work. Like, that's why I have to film this again, pretty much. Um, that took me three minutes to explain. Like, I don't even know if it was worth it. If you're gone already, then I don't blame you. <laughs> um, but can we just talk about Sims 4 Pets for a second? Like, it's just it's it oh it's it's a good pack like it's it's a good pack and i was uh, completely inspired by it like the you know the whole thing in general was just like really like it's well put together uh, the world is just amazing um you know and i was really inspired by that so i decided to make like this barn that was kind of renovated and converted into um a house so there's a barn and then they like painted it up and you know they they made it look fancy and then they added on an extension to like make the house a bit bigger you know so yeah i was quite happy with the end result i thought it looked quite nice um and it's something i haven't really done before it's like i usually do suburban houses but i was completely inspired by that so you know i thought yeah I was pretty happy with it um the landscaping wasn't even that bad and the whole like thing in general like I can make um what are they called I think they're called marquees but <laughs> probably not like those canopy things with like the octagonal roofs because I just love the octagonal roofs and I'm just gonna use them like I'm gonna overuse them is it gazebo I don't I don't know <laughs> Um, you'll see, well, you'll see in the screenshots, I didn't really film the landscaping, so you probably won't see me make it, but you will, like, I think I briefly record it, um, so, yeah, <laughs> I think that is that, <laughs> I don't know what I'm saying, like, 
it's gotten to the point where I'm like completely delirious and I don't know what's going on anymore and like I I've been spent I just spent five minutes talking about something like it's really confusing to me right because I I like five minutes in on the last video I was talking about something completely different but this one I've managed to do five minutes without mentioning anything I was talking about in the last one I didn't even remember what I was talking about in the last one so it's just like every time every voiceover I've recorded it's this completely different starts and then like sometimes I can rack up like because I spend more time talking about something and I think that's my problem because I speed up more and then I run out of things to talk about so then oh, like I tried to take it a bit slower so then with the things I planned on talking about it it fills up the space a bit more <laughs> so <coughs> I'm sorry why did I apologize why did I apologize like I swear that's like such um a British slash Irish thing like we always just I oh like personally I don't know like about everyone but from a personal experience, I like to apologize for everything, even though I haven't done anything wrong most of the time. Like I, I gave you, um, a discretion is that the word? I gave you a warning uh, at the start that I'm gonna be coughing and I shouldn't apologize for it. But then I apologize for it. It's like one day I was in IKEA, right, and I was walking along with my family and I was pushing the trolley full of like really heavy stuff. So like I was walking slow, and it was also really busy there. So we had to like walk down um this like really like you know how the aisles work like they have arrows along and they're like you know they're usually busy because like a lot of people go to IKEA, and I, it, the line was generally slow. And there was this man, um, he was of, like, I think he was Polish, which I don't, I don't know if that has to do anything, but like generally, like people who are foreign to the country are usually ruder, which doesn't really make sense because you think they'd be nicer, like, like we're, we're letting you into our country. <laughs> I feel like this is really racist, but we're letting you into our country to like, you know, live a, a nice life with like, and you're not living in your old country. So like you should be treating the people who actually are native to this country. Like, I'm sure they probably think the same thing. Like if someone Irish went to Poland and then they were like doing, being rude to people, like it's just like, not you know, it's not nice. And um, so obviously the line was already slow and I was like put like lugging a heavy trolley and this man, he banged into me. Like, he was, like, in a rush. Like, to be fair, he was in a rush. But, like, he banged into me, like, whacked into my leg. And then I turn around and I look at him and I'm like, oh, sorry. <laughs> I, did, I wasn't in the wrong. Like, he was the one who banged into me. He said nothing. And then he just, like, brushed past me. Like, swooped past. Like, I don't even know how. He used, like, his ninja skills. And he had a bigger trolley than me. So, like, how did he fit? I don't know. <laughs> but... Like, I look behind me, say sorry, and before I know it, he's in front of me, like, racing ahead. It's just like, why did I apologise for that? And it's just like, I do that with a lot of things. Um, I'm also, like, very, like, you know, I get annoyed with people who, like, don't say thank you when necessary. So, like, if, if you're like, oh, mom, can you come pick me up? Like, you know... Oh, I'm at my friend's house. Do you want to, can you come pick me up? Like I have a social life, you know, <laughs> but yeah, just, just an example. Um, and then my mom, like most of the time she'll pick me up in the, unless she's busy, but like the majority of the time she'll pick me up. And I think she went, she didn't have to pick me up. She didn't have to go out of her way, get in a car, drive all the way over to a friend's house and pick me up. She didn't have to do it, but she's still doing it because she's being nice. And I think, that, that deserves a thank you. Like, it's, it's not hard. It's a one word. Well, two words, depending. You can say thanks or thank you. Like, <laughs> I feel like I'm a teacher right now or something. But, like, it's not hard. And it's just, like, when people don't say thank you to me, it's just, like, why do I even bother helping you? Like, I don't know why I take such offence to it. Like, because it is just one word. But, like, still, it just has... Like, it's one word, but it has so much meaning because it just gives the person who devoted, like, time to help you out with something, like, recognition. Like, that you actually, like, appreciated the fact that they helped you. It's just, like... Oh, I'm... Like, another example. Um, My friend dropped something in class or whatever. I don't know. And um, I pick it up and I give it to him. Then they say nothing. It's just like, 
you like why did I bother helping you like you could have got it yourself and it would have been fine but no I decided to be a nice person and go pick that up is this so hard for you to say thank you like is it that hard <laughs> no it's not that hard <laughs> okay um I'm getting like really worked up over this <coughs> um there we go again I'm not gonna say sorry though because I'm proving a point god damn it um <laughs> so um as pets has come down Come down, as pets has come down. <laughs> I'm sorry, I don't have English anymore. Um, <laughs> I'm moving to Poland now to um, be rude to all of them, uh, like a foreigner, and I'm not gonna speak any English. So yeah, that's my life sorted. Bye guys. <laughs> do, 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 do. I'm walking out. <laughs> no, I, I think the joke died, <laughs> but you know, I still was trying to relight it and I don't think it ver worked very well. But, um. I'm going to address the fact that I haven't uploaded in six days. Um, well, I'm not really going to address that. I'm just going to point out that, like, it wasn't because I was lazy or anything. It's just like, well, partly. <laughs> well, I got the pack on Friday, like, as soon as it came out. Um, it was, like, kind of Thursday night, I guess. Um, but I got it then. And then I was going to build and have something out by Friday afternoon. But then I didn't do that because I got really sad about a personal issue. And then oh, I started it on Saturday and today is Sunday and I finished it on Sunday. And then I started recording the voiceover at four o'clock on Sunday. And now it's eight o'clock and I still haven't got it done because so many problems, but also dinner. So, you know, it wasn't like I've been working on doing a voiceover for four hours. Like that would have been sad. No, like I spent about two hours just like, doing so about two hours like trying to figure out this voiceover and like fix the editing and stuff it was just a lot um but yeah i will probably be addressing it in another video to do with pets since for pets um so expect another video coming out soon <coughs> i'm not going to give you too much information because you know it want to be a secret but then it's also going to be quite sad <laughs> you know maybe i don't know because i don't want to like, I don't want to, re like, reveal myself like that. I don't expose myself to, like, people I don't really know. Because even though I'm quite a dramatic person, like, it's it's a very, like, personal issue. Like, I'm going to address it. But I don't know. We'll see what happens. Um, But, yeah, I haven't uploaded in six days. And I do have a reason. I, I really wanted to um upload. But, like, I it's just, like... Like, it's one thing to actually, like, it's hard to upload a video anyway because you have to, like, put time and work into, like, making a video. And then, like, you know, it's it's a lot. Like, it's still it's still a lot of work. But the, the fact that there was an issue stopping me from doing that, uh, I think I earned the excuse to actually not upload. Like, um, and it, I don't know. I, I hope to upload every second day again. But there's no promises. Like I said... Um, it may vary depending on how long it may take me to do something, um, or how long I like, or maybe I want to break or like, maybe I want to work on something longer or, you know, think of ideas or whatever. But anyway, if you guys do have any ideas for videos I might make, uh, definitely leave a comment below because I really want to get you guys involved with my videos uh which leads me to another point is that i basically want to branch out a bit more um because my last two let's plays kind of flopped uh, and i had a reason because mainly i don't do let's plays anyway so it was uh, i was already going in blindly um but another thing was that like i i i'm not like a big fan of let's plays like I, I generally know how to do them but it's just like it's hard because when you do a speed build you can just sit in silence or like talk to friends or listen to music or watch videos while you build yeah so that's fine and then you you have like 20 minutes to say whatever you want to say or depending on what time and also depending on how long it takes you because you know you're awkward and it makes it puts a big downer on the fact that you can't talk for 20 minutes so that's a problem of mine but like most of the time it, it's all right I mean I'm getting I'm getting through it um but yeah so 
it's just I don't remember what I'm saying. <laughs> I have a memory of Dory, the bloody fish from Finding Nemo and Finding Dory. So you know she got two she got two movie features. Um, so good for her. <laughs> what am I saying? Um, but like my yeah, I was talking. I was on the lines of let's plays. Um, so like it's one thing to just like you know do it by yourself and like play it live mode like because I never do that like I literally never do it like the most I'd ever like come close to is watching my friends do it or maybe watching a YouTube video doing it but like I rarely watch like those types of videos as well because like I'm just not really interested in it but then there's a lot of people that are interested in it and I want like I want like there to be like more options for my viewers because I feel like if I'm only gonna upload builds like <laughs> <clears throat> it's not giving everyone like you know the opportunity to enjoy you know me <laughs> um so like I feel like the biggest problem was that like when you do YouTube videos you have to be entertaining or else no one will want to watch it like it's one thing to film a video um and like make it not interesting like being like hi guys um so I did a speed build or um and then I put the plate in and I um put a plate on the fireplace and then now I'm kind of standing here oh I put clutter there like that's just not interesting <laughs> like personally I the way I think of it is if I don't find it interesting to watch then I don't think any viewers will find it interesting to watch and that like I I've, like I think that like like connects with everything really like no one was gonna like if you do an art piece like if you don't even like yourself like if you do a painting or something you don't like yourself then like how are you going to expect someone else to like it if you can't even find something that you like about it so like well maybe like there's a small chance that someone might like it but like like I, being a moderately perfect a moderate perfectionist like I I like don't want so I don't want to upload something that I'm not proud of really um, and I'm proud of this house, so that's why I'm uploading it. Uh, I might not be proud of the voiceovers that come along with them, but you know, you can always mute me <laughs> or, you know, just listen to music over me. Like, I don't, I don't care. As long as you enjoy the build, then that's, that's, you know, <laughs> um, liking me is just a plus because you don't have to like me. I mean, I don't like me <laughs> and I'm still here. <laughs> what am I saying like I can't get rid of myself but you know that's that's what I like yeah so with doing let's plays I feel like I have to to keep it in like it's hard because like it's one thing to like make jokes throughout the speed build but you ha you can't tell stories in a let's play like, you have to like make the let's play interesting because no one wants to like watch you play sit with sims and just tell stories like it's not like that defeats the purpose of a let's play doesn't it so I find it hard to like you know I'm not a very witty person like I can't come up with things on the spot um but you know I'm kind of comedic I like to think of myself as a jokester as the kids say um <laughs> yeah that kind of just crossed out any hopes I had in being funny but <laughs> what can you do um so yeah the, my what I plan to do is do a challenge of some kind like I hope to I hope maybe I can do the not so berry challenge um because that gives me like even though it's kind of dead <laughs> no one plays it well no youtuber plays it not that I know of anymore well maybe there's a few I don't know <laughs> well to be fair I don't watch let's plays anyway so it doesn't make a difference if I did know um but yeah if I do if I do not so berry then like I have challenges, I have like skills I have to level up, I have careers and stuff. So like it gives it more like interest maybe for me. Um so like I can like I can actually like have something planned whereas if I'm just going into like the I'm just going into it like without having anything planned cuz I'm not I don't plan things very well. Like I'm like I'm organized but in a different way. Like I don't like plan things, which I did wish I did. But, you know, I'm a procrastinator, so I, like, put things off. Um, but, like, 
when I was doing the Hills Legacy, like it was so boring because I didn't, I came, I just went in and I was like, okay, film. And it was just like, yeah, well, <laughs> that's not, that's no, like who would want to watch that? Like I was just literally just being like, I don't even remember. It went on for 40 minutes, I'm pretty sure. So <laughs> I didn't watch the full thing, I can guarantee. And I don't know what I did. I kind of just like introduced them and it was probably really bad. Um, so that's like that's why I want to like give myself more of a challenge because then like I have something to like keep myself going if you know what I mean so yeah I hope to like I don't don't hold me to that I might I may or may not do a challenge of some kind um but I definitely want to do something involving pets because pets is one of my favorite expansion packs in the sims 3 and that was like that's like the main reason why i'm considering doing a let's play because i find so much enjoyment in it um so we'll see we'll see <laughs> who knows um but definitely expect more builds and room builds and casts coming your way because you know i really want to um play more of like the pet creations and like uh try out the new clothes and stuff so yeah definitely expect a lot of like pets related things i have a few ideas in mind so we'll see we'll see and i also really want to try out that vet like crew year as well to be honest i still haven't even tried out the dine out career <laughs> and when did that come out like they're supposed to be kind of similar and the retail one i haven't tried out any like i don't play live mode and i want to because like there's so much like things I'm missing out on I just don't find it interesting but like I like the idea of it so um maybe I I will try like if when I build a more of a fan base like I'll try get you guys involved more and like you know maybe do some polls see what you guys would be interested in um but currently I only have like 60 subscribers which is a lot because you know I'm working my way up the food chain um 60 subscribers 40 away from 100 let's hope that i get 100 by christmas like that's my dream i want to get 100 by christmas uh i don't know if it's possible but, you know i can dream i can dream harold um that's a reference if you don't get um but yeah so that's that's my future plans i did have a story to tell but you know i don't know how i've already run out of time like i told the story last time and i still didn't have enough time like i had like 10 minutes to spare on the last one but this time i i've i have spoken for 22 minutes and i didn't even have to tell a story like i was kind of just made it all up on the spot and i'm proud of myself for that like honestly uh i don't even think it was that bad because there wasn't any awkward silences not that i know of and yeah <laughs> and there was like I think it was decent content. Like, why am I, like, reviewing what I just said when you guys, like, probably have already heard it? Um, most of you probably haven't, though, to be honest, because um, a lot of you only watch, like, five minutes. Like, this is based on my statistics. Um, but, you know, Hannah's probably here. So, hi, Hannah. Um, if you are here, uh, what do you think of the video so far? Isn't it great? It's great, isn't it? Um, so, yeah. <laughs> that is the end of the video i guess probably just gonna end it here because you know i've run out of things to say well not necessarily i could say more but like i don't have enough time anymore so i'm just gonna gonna leave it um if i never have an intro and i still haven't got an intro if you guys have any ideas for an intro you know hit me up message me on twitter or you know uh comment down below um i don't know do what you want <laughs> um so yeah i don't have an intro or no i don't have an outro i have an intro um and i always just make it up on the spot so it's kind of a mess like it's it's like a disaster mess like it's not a good kind of mess but you know <laughs> this is the end of the video if you guys did enjoy this video please make sure to leave a like and subscribe and also comment because you know i appreciate the support it's real <laughs> it really boosts my self-esteem <laughs> because i need it for my ego um <laughs> nonetheless 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 what i was gonna say something but then i was gonna make fun of myself for saying nonetheless but then i said it again so it kind of ruined it um <laughs> anyway i'll see you guys in another video bye boom